Hi everyone! Welcome to our video of 42 Vershire Circle here in the Woodlands. And this is located in May Valley. It's a one and a half story home. And it is 3,092 square feet according to the appraisal district. And it is listed for four eighty nine nine. So let's go in and take a peek at the inside. Okay. So as we step inside, you're going to notice the wood tile floors they go all the way from the front door to the back door as you can see right through the house there's a dining room which we'll get to in just a minute a hallway with a powder room and the coat closet and then here this is technically speaking this is the study but this particular family has a little one and they are using it for the nursery but it does have shutters on the windows and the french doors it also has the wood tile floors and the one thing that you'll notice in the house is that throughout it it has crown molding it's like in many of the rooms this is a little half bath here very nicely done. I love the look of this bathroom. You can see the light fixtures up there. And then here we've got the retro looking sink. So, so stylish. And the little tiles on the floor. Okay. So we continue on back to the hallway where we came in and then over here to the right we have the dining room and then to my left on the other side of the entry hall is the stairs that go upstairs obviously and then the door to the garage we'll go upstairs momentarily. Let's walk into the main area of the house. So here you can see the family room, also the kitchen, beautiful kitchen. It has upper cabinets all the way to the ceiling. Many of them are the display cabinets. So nicely done. It has a Ventura cooking range, high end, I might add. And then over there, you'll notice some appliance cabinets. The microwave that's just sitting on the shelf there, along with the other open shelves. And then the hallway that you're seeing over there, that leads to two bedrooms. And I will say, that there's a pocket door there that you can close those bedrooms with the bathroom off. So back here to the family room, we've got the fireplace, a stone fireplace, nice wall for a TV, the door to the outside, which has a screened in patio, and then the two windows on the side that offer additional light. So back to the kitchen. Across from the kitchen is the breakfast room. And then right behind the breakfast room is this little planning area. And this leads us into the master. So come on into the master. Again, I'm still all on wood tile. The ceilings are high in this room. The ceiling height, by the way, is on 
um, our listing online. So here you can see it has a double vanity. It has the tub. Over there is a closet door. Show you the inside of that. It's a nice size closet. And then here we have the wet closet as well as the shower. So we come back out, we can see how pretty those windows are. And we'll come back out here where the planning desk is. And this bar, this island is a good size island. It has to be probably eight feet by four feet, something like that. Don't, don't take my word on it. You have to come here and measure it. So let's go down this hall. This is where I said the pocket door was. And then here you've got one bedroom, window to the side. You have the utility room here. There's room for a refrigerator if you wanted to put a refrigerator in this room. And then here's the hallway again. And as we go down the hall, there's a linen closet on my right. There's a bathroom with a double vanity. Here, you have to make sure that you see all these nice light fixtures that they've done. Everything's been updated. And then here's another bedroom. Obviously, this is for the princess. So two bedrooms, bathroom, utility room down this hallway. And then we'll go upstairs, back to the foyer, just about. And we'll come up the stairs. And at the top of the stairs, you can see we have this large game room. That doorway there is to the closet, and then there's an attic, a Texas basement that's beyond that. And here's another door to a closet. So we go this way, another closet. Can you say this house has storage? That's a linen closet. And then here we have the bathroom, full bath, for this fourth bedroom. Wow. Then here you can see all the light coming in these windows. It's beautiful. I don't want you to miss the size of this closet because it's big. Look at this. That probably goes back 12 feet and then over in this direction as well. There's the stairs that I came up. So let's go down and we'll take a look in the backyard and see what it looks like. So you can see that we're walking towards the dining room. And then we turn this way to go to the family room. And it's past the family room that we have the screened in patio that keeps it so pleasant when you're here and um, wanting to enjoy the space outside and not be bitten by any mosquitoes. This is all done with pavers and it's continued on outside of the patio or the screened in part. So you can enjoy 
being outside if you wanted to get a little sun. See they have a little swing here. It's a nice size patio. It's probably oh 12 feet by 8 feet or something. It's a pretty good size. So and the fireplace in case you've missed it it has a hearth. So how nice is that to have a hearth that you can actually sit on and get warm on these cold days that we've been having and enjoy it. And it also provides extra seating. Well, that concludes our tour of this home today. We appreciate your joining us. And if you would like to see this home, just call your realtor or have them um, set an appointment or you can always contact us too if you do not have a realtor and if you would like to see the house. So again, thank you and we hope to see you soon.